coming up in a few weeks actually coming up very soon here so joining me today to tell us all about her year and the upcoming competition is miss north dakota sydney helgeson good morning sydney good morning good thanks for morning. having me of course still gotta wish you a big congratulations <laughs> thank you and so what a year right you've yes. traveled i'm sure all across the country all across the state how has it been you know, it's been such a, such a special year. Um, I've been involved in the Miss North Dakota program for about 12 years now. And so it was really special to be crowned Miss North Dakota last June. Um, I was crowned on the 75th anniversary of the program. Um, so that was really special. Yeah. We had a lot of forever Miss North Dakotas coming back. And it's crazy to think that in just a couple weeks, I'll be joining that forever sisterhood. But it's been such an incredible year, like you said, traveling all across the state, mm -hmm. um, doing lots of school visits, just going into lots of communities, making an, an impact, getting to speak, getting to perform as a singer mm -hmm. um, so it's been so special so out of all the different appearances that you've made which ones or one stands out I know you probably don't want to <laughs> pick every single one but what's what's one of the more memorable ones yeah you know it, like you said it's really hard to choose um, I'll maybe give you a couple <laughs> one that was really cool I actually got invited to a national um, conference I got to speak at it was um, an honor society conference that I was involved with in college they invited me yeah. to Cleveland Ohio okay. to be their keynote so I got to go yeah. to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame so that was one of the cool out of state experiences yeah. but um, in the state another big passion area of mine is um, creating opportunities for people with disabilities it's not my main platform but another mm -hmm. um, passion that I have so going to the night to shine prom going to the Miss Amazing competition those were some highlights that also stick oh, out. Oh that sounds like it's been a full year of an yes. adventure <laughs> and one thing too is your grandmother or mm -hmm. great grandmother? My Gran grandmother, grandmother yep. was first runner up for Miss North Dakota too so how how fun is that that it's in the family? Yes that's been another really special part of my journey um, um, like you said, she was first runner up to Miss North Dakota in 1961. Um, so she's what really inspired my start. Um, I also had an aunt that was Miss Alaska. Um, so she was very helpful in helping me prepare for the Miss America competition since she has also competed, you know, back in the 90s, yeah. but still able to kind of help me prepare in that way. Oh, that's fun though to have it. I'm sorry, grandma's just thriving. <laughs> <laughs> right, all smiles. Okay, so now looking ahead here to the next couple of weeks, the Miss Nor uh, North Dakota will be crowned June 5th through 8th in Williston. So that's just right around the corner, right after Memorial Day weekend here slowly. And so what is your role in there? Yeah, so I'll head to Williston in two weeks with all of our Miss candidates. Mm -hmm. um, we do have our Miss competition and a teen competition. So all of our Miss delegates arrive June 2nd, and then that competition is the 5th through the 8th. And so kind of a common misconception that you show up for the pageant just one day, but mm -hmm. our candidates are actually there for a whole week, mm -hmm. um, you know, doing rehearsals, getting out in the community. Um, so we have our Miss preliminary competitions, the 5th and 6th, our teen preliminary on Friday, and then both um, finals night crowning will happen on June 8th. We were talking about a little bit about this this morning. We're like, what parts of the competition are there? We know I'm sure mm -hmm. gowns, one of them. I'm sure talent is another. Yes. What other ones are there? Yes, yeah, so you have your private interview. That's 30%. Okay. So like 10 minutes, you sit down with the panel of judges. And that's it. Nobody else is in the room? Yep. And okay. they get to ask you really anything, you know, about yeah. yourself, about your resume, your platform, that sort of thing. Um, you also do an onstage question, which is another 10%. Okay. Um, your evening gown, like you said, your yeah. fitness, and then your talent. Oh, fitness, um, interesting. Okay, mm -hmm. so it's kind of like everything, the whole. Yes, they want a very well-rounded title holder because yeah. it's a year, you know, you're on the road, you do a wide variety of appearances and events. So yeah. um, they're really looking for someone well-rounded that's gonna represent the state well. Uh, how many ladies are competing in two weeks from now mm -hmm. with both competitions or all of them? Yeah. yeah, so we have 15 in each okay. competition. So, you know, representing areas all around the state um, from different communities. So excited to get all these women together. I think we have a pretty good class. So so mm -hmm. I'm excited to see, see who I'll get to pass the crown on to. <laughs> <laughs> I think, and you get to physically pass it along? Yes, oh, yeah, once fun. the judges, you know, get to make that decision, but I will get to um, crown the new title holder and then hopefully get to support her throughout her oh, year. That's awesome. I'm gonna leave you with one more question. Just how was it competing in Miss America? Oh, it was so cool. I mean, yeah. that's something that you grow up watching on TV, yeah. and so to finally be there, I really, Try to just be present and soak it in as much as possible and walking away with, you know, a new friend from every single state was um, probably my favorite part. It's probably a close knit community and you guys always like you just have things in common and just you find other things and it's, it's got to be really fun. Yes. Yeah. I love keeping in touch with all those girls and I actually did get to go to Colorado Springs for our new Miss America's homecoming celebration because yeah. um, our Miss Colorado won. And so over half of our class, about 26 of us, all got to go down for her celebration. And so that was really oh, special fun. to just get to reunite and connect with all the girls. I 
girls. I bet too. And you have a busy year still ahead, I'm very sure, right? And so <laughs> yes. big plans down the road. Well, in the meantime, the public can come to the competition in a couple of weeks, right? Yes. Get tickets yep. and everything. Yep, tickets are on okay. sale. And if you can't make it to Williston for the competition, um, we also have some live stream options as well. Oh, fine. Well, it's going to be fun. And thank you for just being Miss North Dakota. <laughs> thank you. Yes, thanks for chatting this morning. Of course. Thank you. All right. Well, coming